Oh, hey there. Now, I think I speak for everybody in the world when I say this. If you get in a wreck on the highway and nobody's seriously injured, get your car out of the way first. Then deal with the paperwork and the insurance, okay? If you're a police officer or any kind of EMT person and you come upon somebody who's had a wreck and they called you for whatever in the world reason <clears throat> and there's no injury, get this stuff out of the way and then deal with the paperwork and the insurance. That's what we're supposed to do. And yet, here's what they do instead. Are you ready? Everybody freezes up and goes, uh, uh, uh. And then everybody driving by, they're not gonna help, but they stop and they're like, real slow. Now, <clears throat> let's say that your town has 58 people in it. That would still be an inconvenience. But my town has eight million. And we're some of the worst drivers in the country. Okay, so I, I want to have a flow of traffic and constantly I'm just like, can you please just, I, I wanna take a picture of a fender bender and be like, this is what they all look like. Just look at the picture and reference that and be like, yep, that's a fender bender and you keep driving unless you're gonna stop and help. You hear that in the background? If you listen real close, you hear Bumblebee NASCAR. That's what I want it to sound like when I'm on the highway. I wanna get there, okay? I don't wanna stop. And I definitely don't want, and here's what happens. Let's just say there's a four lane highway on each side. Somebody bumps somebody else and then the cops show up with a fire truck and they take up three out of four lanes or I've seen it four out of four lanes. I'm like, is anybody really hurt? Or could we just get this out of the way first? And I'm not hating on the people that are really hurt, okay? I mean, I cause car wrecks all the time. I'm not in them. I'm not a bad driver, but I get a percentage. Um, I throw banana peels out the windows and whatever damage is done, the insurance companies kick me back. And so, you know, like I'm familiar with car wrecks and how they work. I just don't try to participate in them as much anymore, except for on the, I'm causing the car wreck kind of thing. But hopefully this will help you. If you get in a car wreck, you'll be like, oh, I remember I saw a TikTok video about this. And that would be me telling you, get out of the way first, then deal with your paperwork. Love you.